you guys want to go ahead and just skip the vlog, the time link will be down and no, will be up here somewhere. The time link will be some up here if you just want to skip to the reaction part. So let's go ahead and hop into this vlog. Bang. What's going on, guys? It is your boy, Truly ML Visuals, back here for another video. And today I'm going to be blog, vlog, vlog. Ugh. I'm gonna be vlogging. You dig? So I'm back on here in the camera. I know I said I'm be doing vlogs, but I just, I just be. I just be slacking all the time. Basically, I did this video type of video style vlog and reaction a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? But I, I don't know why I didn't keep up with it. But today, we got another vlog, and I'm going to be talking to you guys about certain things. And by the title, you'll know what we, we're going to be talking about in this video. So let's go ahead and hop into this video. Next thing I want to talk about, hold on real quick. There we go. Man, look what I got, y'all. I got a new camera. Like, that's crazy, ain't it? I got a new camera but let me tell y'all what's wrong with the camera i'll be back in the next clip or whatever to show you guys what is possibly wrong with this okay guys so now i'm gonna tell you guys what is possibly wrong with this let me show y'all okay i got this little thing this is the little light that go on top when you take the pictures right here you go the camera right here it's the olympus e520 now, guys, you probably guys are saying, man, there's nothing wrong with this camera, bro. Like, this is a good camera, and it'll run you about $700, right? But I got it for way cheaper, like way cheap. I mean, like below, a, like, a, like below $150, you feel me? It was a steal, so I got it, you feel me? So listen, look what it, look, it turns on, well, my battery over that charger, but it turns on, I forgot that thing was charging, it probably not overcharged. Oh whatever, but it comes on. It does everything. But the main thing, the person at the store that we got it from, I'm not gonna speak on where we got it from. Just know we got it from the store, right? They said it record video. It does not record video. It does not record video. All it do is take pictures. But as you guys know, that I am in photography, so it's kind of a win-win situation. I'll be able to get higher quality pictures and be able to change lenses and stuff which is pretty cool but the quality of these videos won't change at all no time soon since I just bought this so you guys are stuck I really got a DSLR for video but man it's kind of messed up but everything happened for a reason so I'm going to put this back up and I'll catch you guys in a few seconds you guys I'm always vlogging when it's raining I think it's raining outside. Hold on, let me look outside one sec. I'm gonna get you guys to look outside with me. Oh no, actually it is not raining. If you guys can see that, it is not raining. I'm in a hotel right now. So, but it is not raining. So, yeah, I'm gonna try to go outside later. Maybe, I don't know. But just stick around for this vlog because I might have a few things to talk about in this vlog. This vlog might be a little boring because I don't really don't do nothing. But I just want to show you guys my life. So, see y'all in the next clip. Yeah, man, the camera situation is so messed up because, I mean, they actually, like, then got... Wait, hold on. I probably like a shadow. They done got a rep off us, you feel me? Like, I could have saved my money and got another camera, another DSLR that records video. But, man, it's crazy. But... Like I said, everything happened for a reason, so I'm about to go ahead and sit down and talk to y'all about some things since I won't be going outside vlogging today. Whenever I get my camera gear, I will be going outside, taking you around, guys, showing what I do when I'm outside of this hotel that I'm in, how I take pictures on the outside and make it look like a different scenery. So let me go ahead and sit down and talk to y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next clip. Back <clears throat> in the next clip. Why is the TV loud? Why? Tell me. Tell me why. Tell me. What remote at? Oh, hold on, guys. Hey, guys, I am back. But you guys, you and I, like, you guys already know what's up. I want to talk to you guys about gaining subscribers on YouTube as a photographer, as a content creator, as a video content creator. That's the main focus of this video. I was going to put a reaction in here. Should I put a reaction? Yeah, I'm putting reaction in this video because I know you guys love reaction. So every time you guys see a vlog come out, just know a reaction video going to be into if you guys have been sticking around for this long. Then thank you very much. 217 subscribers. Let's get to 300 by the end of this year or by this time next week would be be like the wildest thing. But 
um, yeah, how to get more subscribers. This is how you get more subscribers. I was sitting over there reading the other day, right? Reading so hard, just trying to, just trying to, um, find out how to grow my, um, not Instagram, oh God, how to grow my YouTube channel even faster. So, and me growing my YouTube channel even faster, I figured out some things that you guys should know on how to grow your Instagram. I actually read all of this. Like, you can check it out and see for yourself. Now, I'm about to sound so technical, but not really technical, but sound a little informative. You see what I'm saying? So, first thing is YouTube checks out watch time. Watch time is the main thing that's going to help grow your channel. If they only watching... 5% of your video, your video is going to get pushed down in the algorithm and nobody's going to ever see it. If you get 50% uh, your video is going to get way pushed up because it's over half of your video. Depends on the length. Now if you make a 10 minute video, if you watch 5 minutes, your video is going to get pushed up there. Just like if you make a 20 minute video you, and it, and you get and they watch all the way up to 10, then your video is going to get pushed way up because that's more watch time. Say 5,000 people watch your video times that by 10, you have probably over 10, you have probably over 15,000. I don't know. I'm not, I, I don't know. I'm not thinking about math right now because I'm out of school. But you basically have 15,000 watch time minutes, I want to say. So if you have 15,000 watch time minutes, that's more than some people get in a whole month or maybe even a whole year, depends on what they're putting up and how long are their videos. But you know, they might say shorter videos are better. Well, if they watch 100% of a shorter video, yeah, they're going to get more views but they're not gonna get more watch time to you. Watch time helps you rank. Some people have two million watch time minutes. That's why they can upload a video and put no tags like Casey Neistat and just put no tags except his name Casey Neistat and he just do amazing because he already have a big fan base. He don't even have to use tags, you see what I'm saying? Next thing is that you got to got to put the keywords at the beginning of your title. I learned that from YouTube yesterday. Didn't even know that. I think that's a major key. Put your, put your um, keywords at the beginning of your title and then the rest at the end. Uh, when you put those keywords in front, that's what's going to help you rank for those keywords. I just not figured it out. I should have been on that. If I had been on that, I could have been on probably at 1,000 right now. Put those keywords at the front of your video and put the rest at the end. Also, Next thing, make sure your title is short and compact because on some devices it's going to cut it off and people ain't going to see the whole thing. Still, that means that you got to do some wordplay. You got to know how to make it shorter and leave out some certain words. Next thing, fourth thing, this is probably the most important thing, upload consistency. Upload consistently. Be consistent. The more you're consistent, the more they're going to put your channel out there, okay? So, in them pushing your channel, you're going to gain more subscribers. It's called momentum. Once you get momentum, you got to keep riding it all the way out because, I mean, once you start, it never stops if you keep uploading. Once you get that first subscriber, then it's going to keep rolling over. I don't know. It might take a long time, but you're going to see growth every time you upload. That's why I'm at 217 subscribers right now. And that's probably the quickest I done grew up YouTube channel in eight months. Yeah, to hit 208 months. That's kind of big for me because I don't do that type of stuff, you know. Fifth thing, final thing, make catchy thumbnails, uh, even YouTube said it itself, make catchy, um, catchy thumbnails as something that makes the video, like the main, like a main scene in the video that's going to stand out, because the more you stand out, the more you get noticed, leads to more subscribers on YouTube, so that's the end of the talk segment, so let's hop on to the next thing. Hey guys, as I said, that was going to be a short vlog today, because I said I'm not doing nothing, I don't have my camera stuff with me hold on one sec where I put it oh well yeah I don't have my camera stuff with me basically what I was saying and so I can't go outside and take pictures and show you guys what I do um so basically yeah hold on guys give me one sec So, um, that's basically it for the vlog because I said I'm not going to do nothing. I don't have all my camera equipment, my new camera. I got to get the compact flash and the memory card for it to go outside and take the picture. And I don't want to take you guys outside and, and be like, man, there ain't nothing to do out here. And I'll probably go outside and just vlog around tomorrow, maybe go to the pool or something. I don't know, but I thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, 
uh, you stuck to this reaction video. So let's go ahead and hop into that reaction video right now. And see y'all later. Peace. What's up, guys? It is the homie, uh, who am I? ML Visuals back here for another video. And today we got Luis Fonzie, Daddy Yankee, Despicado, Future Justin Bieber, Fourth Impact cover. Y'all know the reactions are back on this channel. If you didn't catch my live screen, the reactions are back. So let's go ahead and hop into this video right now. Hi, welcome to our channel. We are four sisters from the Philippines. I'm Almira. I'm Irene. And I'm Eileen. And I'm Selena. And, and we, we are Fourth Impact. Impact. And this is our cover of Despacito. Such a blessing, yeah, to never see the vision in heaven, yeah. Oh, you are awesome, rise on the top. I like this already, y'all. Got me feeling some kind of way, make me want to say forever, moment slowly, slowly. Yeah, you fit me, tell me, love how you put it on. Okay, only key know how to turn it on. Okay, okay, okay. I like this. Despacito, quiero respirar tu cuero despacito. Deja que te diga cosas al oído. I like how they sing it for real. I like how they sing it, bro. It's chill for real. Despacito. Darte besos despacito Fermo en las paredes de tu laberito Es el de tu cuerpo todo un manuscrito Quiero bebalar tu pelo, quiero ser tu ritmo Quiero ser esa mi boca Tus lugares favoritos Favoritos, favoritos, baby Te quiero sobrepasar tus zonas de peligro Hasta provocar tus gritos Okay. Like that. They rap it too. <laughs> I can't make sure remember all that. That's a lot. Like this. Love this song for real. Okay. 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 They're doing really good too. I love this too, bro. It sounds so good in these hands. I'm trying to tell you, I just don't know. <laughs> okay, that's what I like. Okay. I love that, I love that, I love that. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoy this, peace out and stay up to the next reaction, vlog, video, whatever I post. Peace out, guys.